Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with part 7 of our Spiral a Hero's Tale playthrough. In the last episode, we made it here to the beach and did some random garbage quests like saving turtles. Now, I had a few issues with this game where the interlacing and stuff all got messed up. So, it doesn't look like there's anything left for us here to do in this specific area. Though we do have to go to Blink. I almost called him... Called him Blinky and... Wow, that... Did not look like it was on on screen, man. Jeez Louise. We need some health, man. We need some health. Oh, I know what it is. <clears throat> Every time I try and run through, the game is like, yeah, you know what you're trying to do? You're trying to um, run through, so the camera angle is going to completely screw you. Because it's that stupid like active camera that the PlayStation 2 was huge on using. See, it's when you're trying to go forward in a zone where there's like multiple hazards. Also, what was he shooting at? Did you see that? Anyways, like I said, we were gonna go to Blink. Now where is Blink? Oh, he's right there. He just didn't spawn in yet. Hello there, Spyro. Even below ground, it's become extremely dangerous since Red appeared on the scene. But I'm always up for a challenge. You know I love it down there. Can I explore below ground? I guess if you want to. I'm not really looking forward to this, but it has to be done for 100%. Alright, how do we um, use the... Oh, we don't have the bomb right now, so I guess that doesn't really matter, so who cares? Um, what do we got going on down here? Got some mad platforming, which is cool. I don't remember if this one's that difficult or not, but these levels all kind of, uh... Are you serious? What kind of spider has magical powers allow it to arch around the corner like that? Now, come on, Gabe. What, what, what kind of BS is that? At least his ground pound seems a little more reliable than Spyro's. I had issues with this game, like, having speed up and everything, and it was just annoying me. Now, I don't remember if... Like, any of the metal crates in this game actually... Okay, they were supposed to have gems. I don't know what it was, but remember in the uh, first Blink level we did, none of the metal crates actually had gems? Yeah, me too, and it was really weird. Alright, I guess we'll take this before... If we go up, we can go up here to... Oh, another dark gem, and... Oh, great. More shoddy platforming. Or whatever you want to call this, wall gripping mechanics? Because, like, you can't turn the camera with it. Or you can kind of, like, turn the camera, but it's not very, very smooth. And then he just straight up doesn't grab onto the platform. Go figure. Game, you know, you could just be a little nicer to me and, uh, you know, allow me to actually win. Not every level or every episode has to look like a failure, you know? Also, you guys killed it on the first episode of this. By the time I'm recording this, only episode one's been uploaded. Like, I technically have episode uh, two and three uploaded. They're just not out yet. And, yeah, you guys did really, really good on the first two videos. Considering I only have 37 subscribers, and the videos technically got more views than subscribers than almost subscribers, so that's pretty darn good, and you were not falling there, Blink. What annoys me is we gotta do that, and then we gotta jump down so we don't die. Like, my god, this game... And then he punches the dirt instead of cl crawling through it. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to grab that. I wanted to destroy this before I grabbed more bombs. Also, what the heck is that? Why is there a mine there? Apparently I can destroy it, so that's pretty cool. Whoa, I didn't realize that was a moving platform. Are you serious? I didn't even double jump. Hopefully it kept the progress. Okay, it's wherever you get bombs. That That's good to know. I, I don't know why it let go of the uh, platform like that, but it did. There's also another mine over there. This actually does kind of make sense that it would be flooded in a water world. Just I'm not a big fan of the water in this game. 
Okay, well, we got this, which is good. There's a platform here that looks like... Oh, it's the one that we actually have to jump on? Okay. You do have to double jump, though. Um... It doesn't look like we could, um... Shoot our laser when we were on there, so that's something to keep in mind. This is only crystal number three, and we gotta do this again, too. I guess we should really do this, right? Okay, there's a crystal down there. Luckily, there's no fall damage in spiral games, so otherwise, I think we'd be uh, dead right about now. Because that fall was something crazy, and. Uh oh. Yeah, long throw! At least the long throw is good for that. Even though it doesn't really actually come in handy for really anything else. It's the first time we really had to use it. And this should be the last one, and boom! We should be good to go! Nice. Appreciated. Now I can go get our dragon egg and do it once again for a light jam. Yay! Here you go, Spyro. I found a dragon egg. But I bet what you really want is a light gem, huh? Why would there be light gems everywhere anyway? And here we go. Again. Thank you, game. Man, I don't like it here. Like, I don't mind Blink. I think he's a fine character and plays fine. It's just... With the camera in this game, it's what's bad. Thank you, Mr. Spider-Man, but you gotta go. I wanna see, like, just how many uh, differences there are. Like, this level isn't very big. It's just kind of small but clunky, is I guess a good way to put it. We'll grab more bombs, because those also kind of save points. We already have just as many gems, almost, as the last one, because I think we only had, like, five or six hundred, and we already have, like, 250. That's another thing, you don't get a lot of gems through these levels. Alright, so far this is the exact same thing. There's ten crystal, or ten fragments, I think they're called. Dark gem fragments, yet... Um... We've only seen two, and they're in the exact same spot. Like, I get that the, there's the five that'll be in the exact same spot, but then the rest of them are in d random spots. Well, they're, they're preordained, but they're random compared to the first time we played through. And, yeah, there's literally nothing over there, so I guess we'll just go through it. Unless the level gets longer. Or something, I don't know. Because I'm still not really seeing a huge change in level design here. I'm still seeing, like, the exact same layout for everything. I don't see, like, any crystals or anything out here. There's one down there, but that one was always there. And then we'll have the one over... Th oh, there's one down there, too. So there's... There's three. Oh, you can actually snipe the enemies. Okay, that's pretty cool to know. This gun actually has pretty, pretty... Yeah, see, there's another hole down there. That wasn't there. So they just literally added on another zone to this instead of just adding in more. I guess that's pretty cool. They do change up the level a bit, so that's, that's pretty helpful. And then we'll... Kamikaze jump our way down here. And apparently get hit without being able to attack ourselves. So it looks like we get half of them here. Which is fine and dandy. Looks like we got a long throw. Oh, I'm not close enough. That's a shame. It's funny how to, like, long throw it. He just holds his pocket longer. Like, that, that makes sense, right? Longer I hold my pocket the stronger my throw. Yeah, see, we're only halfway done, and we've already technically beat the level again. So we'll go through here and see how much water we have to deal with. That was weird. Did you see that? Alright. Time to snipe me some giant spiders. What kind of spiders are they? Like, tarantulas? 
definitely aren't black widows. Oh, what is this? Really? It's just chilling right here? Also, how do I get across? Oh! I was like, there's no way I could technically get across that as is. There we go. Wait, I can't get up there. I actually have to do the platforming. That is not... Wait, he got two hits in because... I don't think you're actually supposed to be down here, by the way. Wait, or maybe you are. Like, I don't know. Because that spider had, like, spawned in... Um, that wasn't even a long throw game. I guess it worked, though. Oh. Kill the spider before it kills us. That's all I can say. Thank you. Are you serious? He just straight up did not jump onto that. He's just like, yeah, I don't think so there, uh, player. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm actually grips on, so that's not that bad. Uh, let's see, where do we gotta go? All the way over here now. Okay, for this last gem, holy cow. They're really making us work for it, aren't they? And I don't want to get killed by spiders, so I'm just going to snipe them while I can. Even if it means waiting again, I don't want to die to them. Because I would be ashamed to like die here and then have to come all the way back. Even though it's only like a third of the level that we have to go back, this third of the level is longer than the rest. Also, it's funny that they give you a platform here to like go up. Considering this should be the last one if you're not a boob and actually paid attention. So, just saying. And there we go. That should be our light gem. Woo! Only 760 gems. That's that's pretty sad. Like, honestly, that, that is a pathetic amount of gems that we got from that. Light gem. You know, every time I take something out of the ground, there's just that much more room down there for me. All right then, Mr. Blank. And no, I don't want to play again. So, how close are we? We actually don't have that many. We do have, like, an entire area, though, we haven't visited. Also, why am I full health again? Uh, that's not the way I want to go. I want to go back this way, it seems, and go... Oh, no, I want to go up there. Oh, wait. Duh. So, we want to go this way. Oh yeah, I forgot. You can't charge and jump in this game. Every time I play this game, I straight up forget that because this game is weird that way. Alright, this is the water. I need to just straight up go this way again. Got the crab sound effects over here. It's me, Mr. Krabs. Excuse me, Mr. Krabs. Yeah, my way, buddy. I have to check if we have a key or not, because I honestly don't remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, we do. Um, now, which way is that we need to go? We need to go that way. This is just a small loop around, though, so let's go up here. Come on, Spyro. Homie. Die, crap. Like, what I don't get... Well, come off it, game. Also, why does he keep 360-ing like that? That's annoyingly jank. Wait, no, this is the wrong way. We want the one over here, right? Oh, we can just jump up here anyway. Never mind. Oh. I guess we'll just wait for these guys to do their clack attack, and then we'll attack them. Oh no, not more tribesmen. Are you serious, game? 
Oh, we got more piranha water. At least this time it tells us. And floating shells. This is definitely going to be worth a light gem. Like, honestly. What's over there? And then an then an enemy. Well, if we even fall in once, we're dead. So that's that's fun news. Wait, what? Just kill me already, guys. You guys are uh, are kind of failing here. Okay, we didn't die. I Oh my god, this camera, dude. I don't think I've complained about... Actually, no, never mind. There's been a few games in history that uh, had bad cameras. Alright. We need to just get to that platform now, and then we'll be golden, as long as the game doesn't do whatever that was midair. All this for an egg? I was not expecting it to be an egg of all things. Normally the hard to get things are light gems. Also, what is the point of the piranhas if the piranhas are so dumb that they just straight up seem to ignore Spyro? Oh, this is just worth gems, okay. Okay, well, I'll take the egg and everything. Like, I'm not complaining that it was an egg. It was just really confusing that it wasn't something else, you know? So we should be able to go back and get some health now. Which is good. I'm really glad we got that extra hit, though. Because this game and being... Or getting a hit is just notoriously annoying. Oh. It's also funny that we're killing crabs... When the primary enemy here is crabs. God, there's so many areas that we can still go to. We gotta, we gotta go up through this uh, shell. Oh yeah, we still haven't found Cloudy Domain's uh, zone yet. Oh yeah, for these houses, they're a little village. What? Dude, you killed me through your house. The logic there is so stupid. And then the, the house itself doesn't drop gems, which is really dumb. Because normally when you destroy something that spawns enemies in a Spyro game, they drop gems and not the enemies themselves. But according to this, the enemies are what drop the gems, not the building that they come out of. Now we do have a light gem thing over here, which requires 20. I don't even know how many we have. Wait, that shockwave hit me? game. You, you, you're just trolling me at this point. Do we actually have enough for this? We do! We have 20 light gem sacks. This is the secret area. And I love how there's a fairy right outside it and then right in front of it too. Oh, there's an egg thief in here. Okay. Wait, is that a generic Spyro the dragon egg too? Whoa, this is not going to be fun if the controls are like this. I'm back here, you thief. We almost had you, and then the game was like, nah, sir. Um, you do realize that I'm not gaining any distance on this guy game. Oh, I think you're supposed to, like, catch him off guard. There we go. Thank you for the dragon egg. That's 21 eggs. Though eggs do something different. Eggs give you, um, like unlockables. Why'd I do that? Well, I got him to fire his gun, so I guess that's fine, but still, I don't know why I did that. Uh-oh. Maybe if I just casually, like, don't acknowledge them being off screen, they'll leave me alone? My God! Wow, 
why did it flame? I was clearly holding down... Oh, uh, whatever. It's holding down circle, but thank you. Alright, there's still that little dip over there. Cool that we were able to get a secret area, though. I find it funny how, like, the first secret area we found was 70, and then this one was 20. Oh, there's a light gem over here. Oh, we actually had way more than enough. We have 26. I think there's 80 or 90 in total. We already have 10,000 gems again. And we haven't even found, uh, what's it called? We haven't even found, um... I forget what's the word. Actually, I don't even know what, we're what I'm talking about anymore, honestly. I need more health, but the game is probably going to be like, yeah, there's no health in this vicinity. Well, I guess we can go this way. Oh god, there's quicksand now? Or is it just mud? It could just be mud, because quicksand doesn't actually make sense. It's a lot more difficult to die in quicksand than movies made it out to be. Hey, at least we have a save point, so that's pretty cool. Oh, I was going to say, we still haven't found the cloudy domain yet. So why do I hear bees? Why are there bees everywhere? Also, why are the, these platforms yet no way to get up on them yet? Interesting. Oh god, more enemy huts. Luckily their respawn time is pretty bad because of um... Oh thank god. Please be the only one around here. Alright, there's like some kind of mini-game challenge thing here, it looks like. That should be annoying, especially with these janky controls. I think it's honestly just the computer I'm using- or computer. Controller I'm using that's uh, causing so many issues. Oh, really? We have a set time limit to get all the way back here? Okay, this is, uh... Okay. Ugh. Um! Are you serious? We made that, and the game knew it, and it was just like, Yeah, you didn't make that, thank you very much. Oh, they spin too fast when the timer's going. So I think it takes the wind power from these and puts them over there. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm blabbering on about. Yahoo! Alright then. Are you serious? Game, you do realize that I hit that every god darn time, game. Like, this isn't even, like, difficult. It's easy. It's just the camera angle's like, yo, are you actually gonna hit it or not? It's kind of like, it reminds me of that Demi video where he's like, will you bump or not kind of thing. And that's exactly what's going on here. Except with Spyro, because, like, for some reason... They're like, yeah, you know. And I hold down. Wow, amazing game. Man, game, you just. You cease to amaze me. This is a great, flawless game. Also, what happened to those rocks that we could head pound? Or head bash, or horn dive, or whatever the frig it's called in this game. They just keep giving it so many different names that I just don't know what it is anymore. It's like, yes, it's a thing. And you gotta do it. Also, sometimes the audio changes when I die. Like, now that sounds louder in my ear. So I don't know if it's louder for you guys, too, or... I don't know why I glided there, but whatever. 
You know what? Luckily, there's the power of editing, where I don't have to sit through this challenge 50 times because it just refuses to jump on it because guess what doesn't exist? Camera. Either got backwards left and right movement, or you got an automatic piece of garbo that half the time just straight up doesn't work. And like, look at that. We shouldn't have been able to grab that, but we did anyway, because the game is just like... Cool. I wonder if I just... That didn't hit me, game. Do you understand the thing called hitboxes or a working camera? Like, what is that? Why do I like 360 around? That is not how life is supposed to work in this game. Okay, and then Spyro decides to diddle-doddle and climb up instead of actually just, you know, jumping. Cool. I wonder if I just don't do anything and just do this. Okay, you're not even supposed to hold anything. You're just supposed to abruptly let go, which is stupid. And there's something over here. Like it, I think it's a safe, like a, a money bag spot, but at the same time... Still, it could be something useful, I guess. It is! Domain doorstep. I wonder what that means. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure to get... Oh wait, no, that's the domain. Then what's up... Then what's over here, exactly? I don't know. Oh, I think that's to go back. I think. Anyways, I guess we'll take this elevator, because this is where we need to go. So, let's go up. Woohoo! Flying high in the sky, like Herky Pork. Wow, this is exciting. I'm gonna have a drink while we uh, wait for this. This is ridiculous. How long is this elevator ride, game? Holy cow. We finally made it to Cloudy Domain. Hey, those guys are from Spyro 3. Wow, we might as well open this before we end the episode. Let's see what it is. It's gonna be gems, right? Oh. Well, it was a gem. Not the gem I was thinking of. So we got 3, 7, and 8. So anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video and all its frustration, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys all next time. Join the Discord while you're at it.